Well, today I'm going to be replacing the bungee cords in this uh, on the rod holder on our. This is a Sea Hunt uh, Triton 225, and it runs from the gunnels down to the decks. And it, after seven years, it gets to look like this. It wasn't doing much good. I already cut it out, but it was broke. Basically, broke off. So what we're going to do? We're going to do put new bungee in, and I already did the bungees on the uh, starboard side over there, we can show them that. And I did that with hog rings, I put the ends together with hog rings, and I'm trying a different method today, I'm going to just lash them together, and I think it'll be better. Well here's what you'll need for this project, you'll need about 8 feet of uh, 316 marine grade bungee to do the port and starboard side, some wire or coat hanger with a loop bent in the end, this is about 9 gauge here, a sharp knife, some crazy glue, you'll need a torch or a lighter to take care of the frayed ends when you cut the bungee, and some line heavy enough to pull the bungee through the hole after you tie it on. Now let's get to the project. Well, what you do, you feed the wire through the hole where the bungee was. And you take a piece of your line and you tie a, I tie just a clinch knot. Take your bungee and tie a few half inches. And pull through. Just guide it a little bit. Now use the same line and overlap your bungee you know, about three quarters of an inch and put a but you do put a few half inches in that also. Try to squeeze it and just spread this out here. That way when it goes in, it won't it won't come out. You won't have trouble with it coming out. Just put another half hitch in there. And trim off the tag ends. All right, you put it, then you put a couple drops of crazy glue. This is the same thing as crazy glue. I use this for uh, making jewelry. We do a lot of rock hounding, gold prospecting, and I make jewelry for Joyce and my daughter. But just uh, however you pronounce it, C-Y-A-N-O-A, -A, you know you know the name. Everybody knows the name. I just can't pronounce it. But you put just a drop on the line here, and that'll hold You 
This is good stuff. Now I gotta feed it through this hole. See, it won't come out. Now, the original one was screwed in, in the back. And like I said, you have to take this whole panel out to do it like the original. But this works just as good. And when, if you have to change them, it's a heck of a lot easier. Now we'll get do the other one. Well, here it is. It's all done. It only took about 15 minutes, I'd say. And it was a lot easier than taking this whole insert out. And I think it's better. Because now when I want to change it, I can change it every couple of years. Because you know how that bungee stretches out. This was actually seven years old. But I should have changed it years ago. And when you're putting the new bungee in, the other one's still there when you, after you cut it off, but you can work by it. It'll work right past it if you have a little bit of patience. And that's why I used the 3 16th bungee instead of the quarter. I didn't have to ream the holes out. And I think it'll be just as good. It's a marine grade bungee. So if you enjoyed this video, we'd appreciate a thumbs up 
and subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching